Hey everybody, Rookie to Handicapping Thoroughbred Racing from my hometown track, Penn National Racecourse, Grantville, Pennsylvania, on Saturday evening, October the 1st, and this is my dayofthetrack.com race of the day. Let's take a look at race 7 tonight, folks, 8.29 p.m. Eastern Post Time, 6 furlong sprint on the dirt, Phillies and mares, 3 years old and up, race for a claiming person, $19,000. Contenders number five, oh so glittery. Number seven, Victoria Alexis. Number six, one sweet banker. And number two, Island Home. Number five, oh so glittery, takes a big class drop of some 15 track master units. It's been a power run performer, facing better company in each of her last five starts. Jockey David Cora and trainer Bernard Hotton send her post for tonight. They've whacked the toe board with 55% of their entry saddle as a team to date. Number seven, uh, Victoria Alexis, the pace profile leader in this field, spreading at six furlongs on the dirt, comes off a power run win her last time out. Race seven summary, number five, oh so glittery, tops my contenders list, which also includes number seven, Victoria Alexis, number six, one sweet banker, and number two, Island Home, five, seven, six, two, and the seventh from Penn Nat. Bonus long shots, Charlestown, race four, the five to one shot. Number five, unshatterable, drops in class by two units as the speed leader in this claiming field, spurting at seven furlongs on the dirt. Hawthorne, race course, race two, number seven, Loyal Lightfoot, a five to one shot, takes a big class drop, 22 track master units, the overall speed leader for this eight and a half furlong route test on the dirt. So from uh, Penn National on a Saturday night, better place to be. I'll be there drinking beers. Rick Needham for the Equibase Winter Circle and DayAtTheTrack.com reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.